Now, most of your stuff is just completely fictional and crazy, but um, do you ever put little autobiographical events in there anywhere? Well, luckily, I was a very fearful child. <laughs> <laughs> I was afraid of a lot of things. And I can remember that feeling of panic about things. And I use that a lot. That's from real life, uh -huh. that feeling. I can remember that feeling of being a kid and being afraid of something. And I, the only other thing I use is, you know, I grew up in this little suburb of Columbus. Mm -hmm. And I use that setting a lot. I remember what that was like yeah. being out there, you know. Mm -hmm. I've never written a book about New York City. It's sort of a superstition <laughs> of mine. I've never had one take place here in the city. And they're all like suburban type, like from my childhood. Uh -huh, yeah. That's real. And I've never used, and every once in a while there'll be like an incident or something that Spark <coughs> will use, but never any major kind of thing. Yeah. I was at an airport watching a family say goodbye to a little boy. He was mm -hmm. flying by himself for the first time. Mm -hmm. And they were hugging him. The parents were totally nervous. He was fine. <laughs> right? He was going on. But they were nervous and nervous. And I saw the mother handed the boy a note. And then he went off on the plane. And I just watched the scene, and they're all crying. And I thought, what if the boy gets on the plane, and he opens the note, and it says, we're not your parents. <laughs> wow. Oh, my gosh. Great idea, yeah. right? And I used that in the book. Oh, that's I mean, that was inspired by a real life That's thing. so great how you can think of things like I that. I know. I just, you know, you can't really explain that. Yeah. It just happened. Yeah. <laughs> so good, I just used it in another book. Oh, <laughs> this time she gets a letter from her mother who says, I'm so, and she has no idea. Yeah. It's, it's a nightmare room called Shadow Girl. Uh -huh. She doesn't know she's a superhero. <laughs> and she gets this letter from her mother who says, I'm so sorry we'll never see each other again. I hope you'll forgive me. Ooh. And she's like, Well, wait a minute, what's going on? Yeah. <laughs> It's the same idea. She's a superhero? Yeah, but she doesn't know it. No. What kind she of superhero? She's Shadow Girl. Oh, uh, <laughs> that's 